Hello, hello, peeps. Jane 9 here, favorite holistic Jersey girl. I am taking a quick break from work. I said I run an errand. Well, let's be honest. Okay, I gotta. I have to have a confession. I got my car in October of 2020, and while I have washed the outside of it, I have never gotten it cleaned. So I had to. They they close by five, so I had to get here by five to get the interior cleaned. Sorry, I had to confess that. Um, any case, and do tip tip them. I don't. I didn't see anyone else tipping the guy. They're working their booties off. Tip these peeps, man. I don't know, man. I don't know. Anyway, that's not what this is about. It's about hindsight being 2020, and things I wish I knew, because I I realize that I've been in business. Like I have a full time job in in, in IT. I'm curious if you're watching the replay because I don't see anyone on live yet. If you're catching the live, drop hey. If you're catching the replay, drop hashtag replay. Let me know where you're tuning in from. What career, hey Christine, what career you've pursued? I'm just curious because mine, it took me, I changed my majors 10 times in college. I went to Pace University and I changed my majors 10 times. So I'm curious what your major is or what you do, what's your career? Are you a stay-at-home mom? Are you a working mom? Are you a, I don't know, corporate America? Are you in retail, e-commerce? I'm curious what you do um, because I've been in IT for, since I'm 18 and I'm 46, so a long flip in time. And I've been in business, like, because I'm like, I, I've just wanted to be an entrepreneur, but I didn't know what I wanted to do. So I've, do, I've done a lot of different things. And it's been 10 years since I've been on this journey. And things that I really wish I, I would have known then, uh, that I know now, and I'm kind of starting over from scratch here. I just want to share five things. The first thing is that I wish I would have known to learn sales, like good sales, like a sales skill, not like, I'm just sharing this thing. No, I want to learn sales. Um, I w the second thing I wish I knew was how to have conversations with people to be authentic, but also to guide people in the right direction. I don't think I've ever done that. I've always been like either very direct, like you want to look at my thing or I've been very indirect where both don't serve you. Um, the third thing I wish I, w I knew was to be not, not to, I always knew to have integrity, but just how to be myself and, and know that business, whether you're an entrepreneur or whatever you're doing, it's self-development. It's learning about yourself and being okay with putting yourself out there, giving value that we all have gifts. I just, I wish I would have known what my gifts were sooner. Um, and the fourth thing that I, I wish I knew was how to have a little bit more belief and faith in myself. I think that's really, hey Susan, I think that's really important. And if, because if you don't believe in yourself, you really can't be successful in anything. Like I always knew I was good in IT, I learned, but when I was working in, in entrepreneurship, I didn't have that same belief. And I think it's because when we're going to school, we're not raised, we're not taught how to be business people. We're taught how to follow a system. And that I've learned as I've gotten older, I am not a rule follower. I am not a system follower. I am do your own thing, do you and be happy follower, <laughs> follow myself. So uh, the fifth thing I wish I knew was really how to be okay with things changing, right? So in business as an entrepreneur, things were way different 10 years ago than they are today. And it's okay. I, was, I, I always feel like I needed a structure. Like there's no such thing as a plug and play. You're not gonna come into a business and you're gonna plug and play. It's not gonna happen. It's about developing yourself and then developing other people that join you in business. So I'm specifically in network marketing. A lot of people will say, oh, just join me. It's plug and play, all the systems. That's great, but you know what, what I believe in? Is when people join me in business, first of all, I'm leading with all of the intuition coaching. I'm dealing, I'm dealing, I'm coaching with mindset and how you can bring your gifts to the table. So there's people who join me who's a single mom and she's you know growing her own food. There's also a mom who has special needs kids. There's also moms who are, are holistic minded. And so I teach them, what can you bring to people? What lights you up? Because if you tap into what lights you up and run a business from there, you'll never get bored. It's fulfilling and you'll earn money because you can't help it. You're gonna be giving value to people and you just, you can't. So those are the five things I wish I knew. I have to go now. Um, share this out if you got value. Drop some bells if you got some value. Follow me on all platforms. It's Janine Brunetti. Have a great day. Ciao, ciao.